Power 93.7 WBLK. I'm Yasmin Young. This is the 2 to 6 Takeover. As we continue to go through these trying times, one of the things that you might find is that you're having some mental health, whether that is feeling depressed, feeling anxiety, feeling feelings that you might not normally have, or maybe you do normally have them. It's okay either way. Definitely want to connect you with the resources and the folks that can help you navigate through that because it's so important that we make it through this and come out on the other side. And I've got Crystal Powers. She's the Director of Mental Health Operations with Horizon Health Services joining me. Welcome, Crystal. Thank you. And thanks for reaching out to us. So, Crystal, let's talk about just overall mental health. You know, I know a lot of people are struggling right now because we've been in this for a minute and we're not sure when it's going to end. And I know that uncertainty is really what gets to a lot of people. Absolutely. And that's what we're seeing here as well. Uh, I first would really want to normalize the level of anxiety and also depression that people are feeling right now. Uh, It's really important that people reach out for additional services and get some support, uh, whether it's within or outside of their family. And for those people who, you know, may not be used to this, it's okay, right? I I want you to just let people know that we all go through this. You know, sometimes mental health has a stigma, but we all go through our different ranges of emotions and our different challenges. Absolutely. This is really a time where people are grieving for their uh, natural and normal routine, for their relationships. And as a result, Uh, We're seeing more family issues and more concerns even with parenting. Uh, And that's really why we're here to help people. We do offer adult uh, mental health counseling. We offer mental health counseling for adolescents as well as substance use services for people who find themselves, you know, coping with uh, greater use of alcohol or substances. Uh, We offer detox, psychiatry, as well as residential treatment. So before I get into the substance part of it, I want to talk about how parents can help their children who may be having, you know, some mental health challenges right now, who may be feeling that anxiety, whose behavior may be changing because their routine has been disrupted. They're not able to see their friends. They're not living that quote unquote normal life that they had prior to coronavirus. Yes. So number one thing is ask your kids questions about how they're feeling. It's really important that we can start labeling emotions right now uh, that will take away some of the anxiety just in and of itself. Uh, Routine and bringing structure to your day uh, and your child's day is also incredibly helpful. Uh, Number one thing we recommend is mindfulness. So being able to stay present in the exact moment that you're in and trying to stop your mind from wandering to catastrophizing. Got it. Now, for those people who may be reaching to the bottle or another substance to self-medicate during this time, what tips or advice do you have for them? Absolutely. I think that's the number one indicator uh, of of a, a need to reach out. So, Uh, We really normalize that here at Horizon. We understand that this is just a means of coping and use will increase at times like this. Uh, So number one, I would say that you would want to check out our website. Uh, We are horizon-health.org. You can also call 831-1800. We have same-day access appointments. So for anyone who's calling, we can get you in the same or next day. Oh, wow. Are there any like 24 hour hotlines? You know, some people may be up and it may be really going through it at 2 a.m. Yes. Thanks for asking. Uh, So family support 24 hour helpline is 892-2172. And that's for any parents who may be feeling overwhelmed right now. Uh, And then also the National Suicide Prevention Line, really important right now. That's 1-800-273-TALK. Uh, And they do have a text line. I know that a lot of people feel more comfortable with texting instead of making a call. That's 741-741, and you just text the word HOME. I appreciate it. Thank you, Crystal, so much. This information is so important, especially at a time like this. So I appreciate it. And if you missed any of that info, I've got that on our website at WBLK.com. Crystal, thank you for your time. Of course. Thank you.